guys, so it's me, Ashley, Hamster Love for everyone here on TPPL. Um, Day Possum Pet Lovers, that's kind of like what we say now. I just have Sugar right here. Um, she just randomly laid down in front of the camera when I was setting it up. But anyway, so this week's theme is um, your pet's daily diet, and I'm going to be choosing hamsters because I don't really know why, I just want to choose hamsters because, you know, I just. I mainly do hamsters but yeah so yeah so this is going to be all my hamsters um, daily diet and the challenge this week is to chew a toilet paper roll like a hamster or a gerbil would <laughs> so it's kind of a weird challenge Christy picked this ch week's challenge I picked last week's challenge and Leah's gonna pick the next week's challenge so <laughs> Yeah, we all get turns to pick challenges and everything. And, uh, Sugar, are you going to go to sleep? Are you going to sleep? You go, girl. You're so, so cute. But anyway, so, yeah, let's just get on with what I feed my hamsters every day. Sugar, oh, a yawn. <laughs> Sugar, you got to get out of the way. I got to film a video. <laughs> So, here's basically my hamster's, um, seed mix. This is their food that they get every single day of their life. Well, sometimes I change it, but, yeah, there's two main things I feed my hamsters every single day of their life. That's food and water. <laughs> so, you couldn't live without food and water. No living thing could live out without water. So, um, and most living things need food, except for plants, but plants in the wild don't have plant food. But anyway, so, um, a mine scene mix. Oh, God, I'm just kidding. Um, oh, the hamster scoop is covered. Anyway, so, I'm going to be telling you guys what I feed my hamsters every day, um, what treats I give them. I don't give them treats every day, but, um, I give them treats kind of often. Sugar's in the middle of the camera. Good thing I'm zoomed in. Um, <clears throat> I always say my mistakes on camera. I don't know why. I kind of think it makes it funny, but I don't know. But anyway, so yeah, let's just get on with this video because it's going to be pretty long. Okay, so there's two things I feed my hamsters every single day. So one is obviously food. This is just my hamster food bucket. It just looks like this. This is the hamster food. I'll get into detail um, later on in the video. But um, this is my food scoop. And um, it's a little clay hamster right there. Look. Okay. okay, my camera's really good at focusing, but it's a little hamster holding a strawberry, and he's wearing a straw, um, an apple hat, and this was made by Chocolate Colors 26, and, um, yeah, it's one-eighth little cup, just so you know, and, um, yeah, my hamsters get one-eighth little cup when I put it in the dish, and this is what my hamsters' food dishes look like, most of them, except for two of my hamsters, so, yeah, but I only have six food dishes because I, I have seven hamsters, but my dwarfs share a food dish because they live in the same cage, but, um, yeah, it's just a ceramic blue food dish from PetSmart, and, um, I like using the ceramic ones and the low-sided ones so that they not tip them over. Oh, you can see my camera. Um, so you can't tip them over, but it kind of sits there and it's hard to tip over for a hamster. And the next thing, this is actually a broken water bottle. It's got a hole in it right there. It's got a crack. Um, but basically it just represents water, just because I have this. And I wanted to take the hamster's water bottles away because most of the hamsters were drinking out of them. What a coincidence. Anyway, um, so yeah, my hamsters get water in a water bottle, not in a dish. And yeah, they obviously get water every single day. So, let's get into detail on what my seed mix is made up of. Okay, so this is basically what my what the hamster's food mix looks like. Um, I just recently made remade the food mix because I was running out. Um, so it's nice and fresh for you guys. I wanted to wait until that so that you guys could see fresh food. But here's kind of a close up of what the food looks like. There is like no corn left in here because um, I picked it out. Picked it out. There's pellets. There's these green and um, orangey things and pieces from sunflower seeds. Some oats and some like um, wheat germ and barley and um, these um, what are they called? Martin Little Friends pellets and a few peas and yeah just little seeds too and yeah and some Living World one of these things probably a bad demonstration um these are called those Living World no that's not one but these are like those donuts but they come in the Living World food oh it's focusing good um and there's different colors I don't know if I should take these out I think I'm going to end up doing that I'll put a little thing on the screen if I ended up doing this but um, yeah so that's what they look like and they come in, they can, you can buy these, but if you buy a Living World food, it comes in them, so, yeah, whoa, focus. Okay, so, and then there's these pellets, and these pellets, and these pellets, and <laughs> the, these pellets, 
Um, this one reminds me of guinea pig food, this one. And then the other one's just, yeah. Anyway, so, what this seed mix is made up of. So, sorry, my hands are bad at this. Um, so, my seed mix is made up of a bunch of different things. So, the main mix I use is hazel hamster. I'm just going to kind of zoom out on it. And this is the old bag because it doesn't, it has the boy, I'm just going to call it a boy, I'm not going to call it now, but it's a little boy um, hamster. And um, this is just basically what it looks like, if you've never seen the bag before. And yes, I kept the one with that really chewed it, because this was the last bag I bought before the um, new version came out. Um, but the new version, all it has is a little girl hamster on there with like a bow or something on it. Um, but I have the, the food in the freezer, so it just basically looks like this. I also use Carefresh Complete Menu, which is mainly the most pellets in this food over here. Um... It just looks like this, and um, yeah, it's for hamsters and gerbils. <coughs> it's gonna get really, really long. This video is gonna get super long, but I also use Mar uh, Martin Miller's Little Friends Hamster and Gerbil Food. These are just pellets. It looks just like Oxbow, but this is the brand I bought this time. So yeah, they just look like those. So back to the seed mix. It basically looks like this. Now you kind of know, get an idea on what's in here, and um, yeah, kind of. But if you want to look what, like, that's basically pieces except for this one pellet. It, these are basic pieces of the hazel hamster, like the chunkier pieces, and there's some seeds and some flower seeds um, in it. Oh, that's not hazel hamster, but yeah, that's kind of what the hazel hamster looks like. And then there are a little bit of seeds. I did add in a seed mix because hazel hamsters are a lot chunkier, and I do want chunks and seeds because, as you can see, look, there are nice seeds in here too because I mixed mixes together. I do mix in... A different kind of like different mix each time like um, this time I mixed in a living world food because um, of the seediness and everything but I'm not gonna go into detail like that but this is all the corn I picked out of this food <laughs> just some sour cream container corn peas and um, like papaya chunks that is a 500 milliliters so I was just, I would say that's around 400 milliliters maybe um, more I don't know but <clears throat> That is a lot of cherry peas I just made m making this mix. And I only fed my hamsters once, so that was probably about that much food gone. So, yeah. And another thing I do add into their food, not every day, but every couple days or every second day, is oats. I do add it into their mix just in case I forget, but oats are very healthy. But don't feed too many because it can cause constipation. So, another thing I add in if there are hard to any sunflower seeds is sunflower seeds because these are very healthy and I just chuck them in there mix it around sometimes and bam it's good I didn't actually add in when I made this seed mix so I'm gonna do it now but anyway that was basically what it looks like so you get the idea and I'm gonna show you what they get every day so every not every day, but when the hamsters eat all their food in their bowl, not when they hoard it, but um, when I know they have eaten the most part of their food that I can get them to eat, I fill up their dish, and usually it's empty because they've eaten it, but this is one eighth of a cup, and they do not eat this every day. They eat it every, about every two or three days because my hamsters don't, I don't feed them every single day because it's just a waste of food. Um, so I just get one eighth of a cup, put in their dish, and sometimes I'll add in, if it's the Syrians, I'll add in one corn, or one pea, or either add in some oats, and make sure they have at least one sunflower seed, and if I want, I can give them, um, more, but there's two sunflower seeds in here. If you can see, there might be more, but, yeah. So, yeah, that's just basically what they get, and then every two days, I fill up their water bottle two, three days, because I don't fill it up every day, because, um, they don't drink it, and, um, it still stays fresh. So, yeah. And now onto the treats. So my hamster treat eight have a ton of different types of treats, and, um, every day I don't really give them a treat, but I would give them some sort of treaty thing, just to keep it interesting. Um, I don't give really any of these, like, any of these type of treats. These are, like, my sugar type of treats, because it's in my organizer. Oh, sorry. Um, but I'll maybe give, like, um, what's it called? Maybe I'll give a sprinkle of this in my food, which is a trail mix type thing, or a little sprinkle of these in there, or I'll give them a few pieces of banana, or a piece of apple, and this is towards my scene. My dwarfs don't get a treat every, every day, or very often at all, because, um, because they are prone to diabetes, and I do not want that happening. <laughs> but they'll usually get, like, an oxbow pellet, or a dog treat, mainly a dog treat, because I really like them. And, um, yeah, so, my hamsters don't really get treats every single day, but once a week they get a good yummy treat, and the dwarfs get, um, a treat also, but they don't get it. Like, I'll be a sugar treat, like a yogurt drop, I don't even give them a yogurt drop. Giving them a yogi once in their life, so, yeah. And also, once a week, or once every two weeks, I will give, usually once a week, I will give them 
either scrambled or boiled egg or a dog biscuit and vegetables that I choose and I make them their own little um, salad so yeah so yeah guys that's basically my hamster's daily diet and um, it's not too interesting or too complicated but yeah so now let's get on with the challenge so this week's challenge was to chew a toilet paper roll oh, dropped it <laughs> so here's a toilet paper roll um so chew it like a extra wood i'm pretty i would think this is really easy because it's just cardboard and you know you can just um, rip it easy like that so I don't know how this challenge is going to go, but anyway, so if you guys want to do this challenge, comment down below and leave leave a video response to this video of you eating or chewing on a toilet paper roll, and we'd, love, we'd all love to watch it. So, and yeah, let's just get on with the challenge. the toilet paper roll looks like and I made a big mess well you can't see the mess but yeah I made a big mess so I'm just gonna go ahead, I'm gonna have to clean that up but yeah so if you want to do the challenge leave it as a video response below and you don't to watch it so this didn't turn out as good as I thought it, I thought it was gonna be super easy but Turns out it's not actually that easy because you're like, I don't know, your teeth aren't meant for chewing stuff like that. But this challenge is still better than eating a small pet treat. Even though that I didn't choose a hay treat like Olivia did, but I didn't eat a, a human treat like Christy did. I don't know. I think we're all, we all did it. We did a good job. But anyway, so yeah, guys. So thanks for watching and. You can see me every week on TPPO. So, yeah, bye.